yes, you do need to grunt for more power. So let's take a look at what that actually means. Hey, it's Bunner from acetennisonline.com where I help you level up your game. So let's take a look at why grunting is so important. Now, when you grunt, it doesn't mean you need to be loud about it, but grunting in this case means exhaling. So what happens when you grunt is you exhale. And that's what you want to do when you are hitting the ball. So let's take a look at Andre Rublev here and just listen. Okay. Now, does that mean you need to grunt as loud as he does? No, it does not. But I do want to make sure that you exhale. And if you gain value from this video, make sure to hit like and subscribe and watch all the way to the end. It shows YouTube that you love these videos and you want more coaching tips. All right, so when you are exhaling, you're relaxing your muscles more, you have greater ranges of motion, and it's going to be a lot more easy for you to be efficient when you are generating power. So when exactly should you begin to exhale? The answer is this. Once you begin your acceleration with your body, you want to start exhaling. So take a look at you. So once Rublev takes his final step here, as you can see, now he begins to uncoil and accelerate with his body. So see, he's uncoiling and he's turning and rotating into that shot. And that's exactly when he wants to start exhaling. So take a look. Boom. And so he's starting to exhale and grunt right through his strike. So make sure that you go ahead and film yourself, uh, take a camera. And for this experiment, I do recommend that you grunt so you can hear yourself and make sure that you are exhaling as you hit it. Now, once you get used to the timing of it, you should notice a difference when you are generating power. You should be more relaxed and it should feel more effortless. Now, does, it, does that mean you're going to hit twice as fast? Probably not, but it should feel like you're trying less hard to generate power. So you should feel a lot more effortless when you are generating that power, and that's going to be a great start for you. So make sure to apply that tip to get more power on your forehand, your backhand, or your serve. Once again, smash that like and subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next video.